Welcome to this video and for the third time we have the same opponent Alexander Knight c3 again Okay, I played different now Let's play the the normal stuff here um, Maybe f5 also Which knight to take is better? Maybe this one. Um, yeah, he will play d4. My pawn on d6 is weak. Yeah, pretty weak it is. So can I, def I can win a bit of time here taking him here. Well, I play d5, takes, 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 and at least I have this diagonal. Um, this is not that bad maybe I think I do this yeah so he wins a pawn but I have a nice bishop here on on b7 later on um, where to put my queen a5 is <laughs> not the best square for the queen f6 mm, and then he will play queen d6 here mm, queen e7 maybe attacking this looks good ah but then queen e5 queen e5 or i just check him here no, I want to keep this check in in place. Okay, let's let's do this. And then bishop b7. Bishop e6 might be also an idea. I'm low on time. I I think I have uh, drawing chances here, and maybe even some kind of attacking uh, chances on this diagonal. So this bishop is a monster on, on b7. What did he do? a3. I mean, let's just imagine my, my queen is on c6 here. Um, threatening queen d5 looks good to me maybe rook d8 next which rook oh this one also looks good um, okay I sh surely don't want to trade here. Maybe queen to g4 or h3. So the white squares are really not in good shape for white. A rook to d8 maybe. This bishop, I don't want the bishop to be unprotected, so maybe I take this rook. The square f7, however, might be also weak after 95, 95, rook e7, something like this. 
and then he opens up the diagonal here so it's pretty sharp uh huh so here we go Wow. What's going on, man? He takes queen d1. Oh, this is not enough. He can just retreat. What did I do? Oh God. This is checkmate. <sighs> is there something? No. Thanks for watching.